in this question we are given that rectangle ABCD is inscribed in the circle and we need to find the area of the circle now over here ABCD is a rectangle right so all of these angles are 90 degree so that's an interesting observation now let's join B and D and BD will be passing through the center of the circle why is that so because over here we have seen because ABCD is a rectangle this angle over here is 90 degree and the angle subtended by the diameter of the of a circle will be 90 degree that means BD has to be the diameter or BD will be passing through the center of the circle right only if BD passes through the center of the circle will BD be the diameter all right so this angle over here is 90 degree and so BD is the diameter so that's what we just now discussed so this is 5 this is 12 right this is a rectangle so opposite sides are equal so this is 5 this is 12 this is 90 degree so as per Pythagoras theorem BD will be equal to 13 right or it will be square root of 12 square plus 5 square which is equal to 13 now you can do this fast if you remember that 5 12 and 13 are a Pythagorean triplet so if you have 5 and 12 as two sides even without calculating if you know the Pythagorean triplet you can say that the third side of the right angle triangle will be equal to 13 now BD is the radius and the diameter BD is the diameter and we have found that BD is equal to 13 so the radius will be equal to 13 by 2 and the area will be pi r square which is pi into 13 by 2 the whole square right now let's try to simplify this this is pi into 169 by 4 right and this simplifies to 42.25 into pi which is answer option b right 169 by 4 that's somewhat more than 40 right so you can you don't need to find the exact value if you look at the options you have 36 pi 42.25 pi and 64 pi right so 160 by 4 is 40 so this is a little bit more than 40 so the answer has to be option b now let's look at what is being tested in this question you should know that the angle inscribed by a diameter is equal to 90 degree in a circle right so you have a circle let's say this is the center so this is the diameter if you inscribe any angle over here this angle over here will be 90 degree so this is something that you should know and then the Pythagoras theorem is something that you should know and if you know the Pythagorean triplet 5 12 13 you can do the calculation even faster and then finally you have to find the area of the circle now do subscribe to this channel to get notified when I release the next video and check the description to know more about my other GMAT programs all the best in your preparation